My pregnancy was not easy, to say the least. I found out I was having twins. Throughout that, they developed twin-to-twin -twin transfusion. And it was a blessing in disguise because we were able to find one of the girls has a heart defect. At the end of my pregnancy, I got preeclampsia. I was life lighted up to the U. Once we were there, I was able to have contractions and all that. It was shift change, and the nurse had this feeling just to check me one last time, and so she checked me and she noticed I was bleeding. I actually abrupted where all hands had to go on deck. A ton of people came in and they whirled me out. It was emergency, C-section, right? So they had to try and cut me open and I felt it. I said like, oh, you know, and then they tried again. From there, I don't remember anything because they just had to like knock me out solid because they had to get them out. Brooklyn, I think her heart rate was dropping fast. We all had to be revived that night just because of what had happened, which is crazy to think about. So grateful for the staff and their willingness to jump right in and those protocols were already put in place to save our lives. Brooklyn, she was at the U Hospital and then Callie was over at Primary Children's Hospital and she's the one with the heart defect. The nurses there were a huge support to me because I could not be in two places at once. And so it was nice because they were able to take care of them when I wasn't able to. We call it our home away from home because Callie's had now nine surgeries. I know that nurse was in the right place at the right time. She went with her gut feeling and how thankful I am for her to not just, you know, go throughout the day, go through the motions, but to actually take charge and take care of her patients. I'm excited for you all to gain the additional training in Zero Harm. Don't take this training lightly. It can be a matter of life and death. I want to reiterate again how important you all are. As a mom, of one of your patients, thank you again and again for all that you do. As we caregivers work as a team, we can help obtain zero harm.